Hello, everybody. This is my audio test of a USB microphone that I purchased a while back and haven't really done anything with since then until now, as well as a test of my audio recording app that I just installed on my tablet. I have interest in creating a podcast for the line dance community and speaking with many of the notable figures within that community, whether DJs or choreographers or the fancy dancers in the front row of pretty much everywhere I go, or the people who are just starting out for the first time, or the people who teach and don't get out to venues as often, but just kind of hang out in uh, their dance studio or uh, fitness center, wherever it is that they express their version of line dancing. Uh, this is for all of you people. And I hope it will be as instructive for all of you and informational as I hope it will be for myself, because I have so many questions for all of the people in this community. It's very refreshing also just to know that all of you are out there, because I'm from Sonoma County, or I guess in the past 10 years I've been from Sonoma County, and the scene is different here <laughs> than a lot of the other places I've seen so far, like Southern California, line dance places everywhere you go in every direction. And up here, we had a really good one in Petaluma, that closed, and another one in Santa Rosa, and that closed. We have one in Katati and one in Santa Rosa that are both 21 and over, so you don't get that crazy, youthful, 18 and over college people energy as much as... Um, you know, whatever it is that the 21 and overs do. I'm 21 and over as well. I'm uh, actually 29, so um, yeah, I'm, I'm in that camp. But man, I, I like the, um, the feeling of places like the Davis Grad where they have 18 and overnights or Stoney's where they have 18 and overnights. Um, what we have here is kind of a more subdued line dance scene and... As I continue to ramble, I guess the, the point I'm making is that I I occasionally catch glimpses of the crazy, fancy dancing people out there um, at different places. And since I can't always be there myself, being here in Sonoma County, I hope to uh, connect with you all virtually and connect you all to one another virtually through this podcast and any commentary that may follow from it. Uh, in which I'm sure all of you will carry on your lively discussions. All right. Well, I think that's about long enough for this intro and demo and test. Um, thanks for listening.